bad news to every Unreal Engine developer that use Quixel. So before Quixel was free and this will be free until the end of 2024. And in 2025, we need to pay to use all of these assets if you don't have yet in your library. So every asset that you have in your Epic Games account, we can still have and will be updated the license. And right now, Mega Scans are totally free for Unreal Engine projects. This asset was used in all of these big productions, movies and games, people away. So what we can do is we can sign in to your Epic Games account and you need to download the... You can download. After you download, you just do the your login. Make sure to use your Epic Games account that have some marketplace items. So this will be licensed to your use and it will be very, very good. Until December, we can grab everything for free. After that, we need to pay. Right here is the Quixel Magiscans library and this is what I have it. However, I need to reload because I grabbed like 100 assets in the last minutes. <laughs> so I'm going to show to you how you can use this. So first of all, you need to go right here in the Quixel bridge. I've already downloaded and installed it and then I log into my account. So this is my account. You can see everything that you already purchased. And I'm going to show to you my method to download everything. So I download like 100 assets, maybe. Uh, make sure that my account got the license to use. And then we can use the Quixel Bridge to download the project, the assets. So first of all, this part right here means if you click in each asset, you can see right here I have purchased it. And this got this check mark. However, some of these other assets, like <laughs> very, very below this part right here, like these ones right here, we just have this icon to download. So first of all, you need to go to settings and you choose the library path for Quixel. If you want to delete the things faster later, you can use some SSD. However, right here, I got my hard drive, so not is a SSD. And this is my location. So if I click right here, I can select the folder. This will be saved right here. So this is like eight terabyte hard drive uh, right here, as you can see. And what I need to do is Simply choose one folder right here and we can download it. All right. So after that, you need to click in some asset right here. I choose the 2K resolution. Normally it will be 8K resolution. So this is a very big asset. I will put in 2K. I go right here, click in download settings. Okay. So this is my total size right now in download. So just 2 MB. And right here in the Quixel Bridge, what you need to do is put in 2K resolution. Right here in download settings, you uncheck everything. In the models, you uncheck everything also. Make sure to be FPS, U asset. Go to back. Click right here again, export settings, textures, click in surface. And instead of in uncheck, you need to click right here to delete every map. Now you go to 3D asset. And do each, do this for every uh, 3D plant, and everything need to be right like this. Okay, so I've already downloaded, I already removed it, the maps from the other sides. In models, you also uncheck everything and let like Unreal Engine FPX you asset. So right now, everything right here, I can grab. So I can everything that is checkmarked. Is mine already. So let's see if we have something else. I think I choose everything. So right here, I will click in combine it. And now I can simply download everything that I want. This is more easy for me. So we are downloaded just the previews. And I got all the assets in my license. 
So we can use this later when have launches. It will be great, right? So I think it's just it. And I will click in cancel. So now I will open my folder again. I will re-verify the file. So 25 GB only. So if I open right here, I have all of these new files. If I open some of them, it will be just the previews and some PNG. You know, so don't download anything else. So this is just the previews. So we can visualize it in our library. And my total number of purchase is right here. And I can, of course, reload. So 635, let's see now. Uh, 67. 670. <laughs> All right. 